Hey everybody, it's Coach Rex again. So before we get into the workout, before we even get into the warm up, I just wanna show you a little bit about what I mean when I say we're gonna offer you ways to stay active, ways to stay busy, ways to get better at hockey without using up too much space or too much equipment. So as you can see, I'm in a room right now. I'm in a, I'm in a basement, we got a closet back there. I got my skate chair opener right over here, okay? This room is about 25 by 15 feet long. And I'm gonna show you how to do a lot of stuff without even using all of that space. Some of, the, some of the stuff we're gonna do, we're gonna either maybe go upstairs to the garage, maybe we'll go outside, but we can figure out a whole bunch of different ways to use this space, to use this as small of a space as you may have, we can use it, okay? So now before I show you about each of these pieces of equipment back there, right? I do wanna say, weights are good. Weights are okay as long as we are using good form. So when I say that we're using weights, it doesn't mean that we're gonna start off just using as much weight as we possibly can. A lot of this stuff is body weight. We're not gonna use any weights at all, right? Some of us don't have weights. That's another reason I wanna show you this. A lot of this stuff I've actually made or I just had lying around the house. Okay, so I have a few things that maybe you'd find at your gym, maybe you have at home, then a few things that it took me about five minutes to put together. Okay, so I'm gonna to cut to a new angle. I'll show you what each one of these are. I'm gonna go through a few different, uh, different pieces of equipment, right? Some of them that I made, some of them that I already have. Give you guys some ideas. We can really get creative with this, as you're gonna see. So first thing that I've got, that I already had. It's a medicine ball, right? 14 pounds, nothing too special, nothing fancy. We can do a whole bunch with it, okay? After that, just a big blow-up ball, right? We can do a whole bunch of stuff with this. As long as we get it blown up, we get, uh, we get it nice and firm. We're gonna be able to have a lot of, a lot of good workouts with that. Right after that, I got plates, okay? So these come with barbells, whatever it is. I got a 10, I got a 25. Again, I would suggest that we probably start off with less. Probably start off with about five, maybe 10, depending on what we're doing, okay? And now, maybe we don't have any of those. That's okay, right? It's a couple of our options. One, this is a milk jug. It's got a gallon of water in it. Weighs about 10 pounds, probably about eight pounds, right? We make two of these. That's 16 pounds we have to work with. We can use both hands. Another thing that I've made, right? This is just an old hockey stick. You can see on each side of it, I got two pucks taped to it, okay? Hockey's a balanced sport. We do a lot of stuff. We gotta stick out to our side. Right now, I'm a little off balance because I got weight bringing me down. We can use this for a lot of training too, okay? Now last, I actually just saw them because they were sitting down here. This is a bocce ball. We've got a whole set of them right there. Maybe you got yard games. This weighs maybe three pounds. It's not very much. Like I said, that's a good thing, right? Because then we can learn about the technique. We can learn about proper form without much weight slowing us down. But if we need a little resistance, we can start to add it, okay? So that right there, six different things. Six different pieces of equipment that, I'll say three different pieces of equipment that I don't have to make, don't have to go out and get, just household items. I also heard, and I also used to use, if you got a big can of, a uh, tin can full of canned vegetables, right? Each one of those is two pounds, three pounds, depending on the size. We can start to use that stuff to incorporate just that little bit of resistance that can help us get better. So, to cap it all off, right? I've got a space here, it's about 20 feet. It's really only about five feet wide. That's all I need, right? I can go outside if I need more, maybe up to the garage, that's fine. But for a lot of the stuff we're gonna do, it's gonna be either in this room or a similar space size, or a similar size space. 